So in this video, I'm gonna walk you guys through a two bedroom apartment that we have at the Signature. You know, this is a building that, you know, is kind of changing the skyline of Ghana. Everybody knows of this particular building. So I'm gonna walk you guys through this. Uh, initially, this was my dream, right? But three years ago, uh, I saw, I think, Vanessa Camby advertising this particular building. And I'm like, wow, this is amazing. It was under construction. Uh, they had like the core shell done. So for you guys who don't know the core shell, it's kind of like the look of the building that you could see the 3D how it's supposed to look. And I'm like, this is amazing. So I was shooting for the studio bedroom, but I didn't have the money at the time. Though God was telling me to buy it, I disregarded that. I was scared because I was building my house at the time and you know, paying for farmland, it was just too much. And I didn't go through the deal, um, which I regretted later because uh, a few months later I had the money. I could have actually done that, right? And now, you know, I have a few friends out here that own like, you know, three bedroom apartments, studios and all that, and their Airbnb is doing really well, right? So where we are right now is a property that I'm in charge of. You know, I, I, you know, I've been signing all the documents and all that is for a family friend, basically. So I'm in charge of this, really with the decoration, with everything, basically, it's almost like it's mine, except my name is not what's on it. <laughs> so I'm going to walk you guys through this. It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful finishes that they have in here. Uh, they pay attention to details. So um, if you ever plan on staying in Ghana, you know, husband and wife, kids, you need two bedrooms. Uh, we got the best price in the market. And this is like a very high end staying, right? Um, I'm not going to put a price out there because it's going to change over time. So I'm not going to let you guys, you know, I'm not, I'm not going to say that. But uh, the price is really, really, really affordable. That's what we're trying to do. We're not trying to be, you know, things can be really expensive in Ghana, right? Especially when you come to nice places like this. But, you know, enough talking. Let's dive into it. So here we have with the kitchen, uh, you know, most of this stuff is like locally made. And the fridge is built in. Bash appliances, you know, they really cared about the quality of everything because Bosch is not cheap. These are the appliances that I have in my house, you know, is, um, is, is, is really expensive. Bosch is a German brand, high quality, and it's very expensive. It's not cheap. I have the same microwave. I have the same washing machine. I have the same extractor. But the hub is an electric stove instead of gas because uh, you know, it's a fancy apartment and the connections and all that, they wanted to avoid it. But, you know, you see the talent, very minimalistic, white. Uh, we have yet to peel, like, they have, you know, they have, like, they have, like, plastic going over this stuff to help minimize the amount of scratches while they're doing this, right? So we have to peel all these off. That is a lot of work, right? So the only thing we have now is the bed because I just got the keys on Friday. Today is a Monday. I got the keys on Friday. So, you know, beautiful, beautiful. So now I have to put a place together for people to stay in and we have to move faster with it, right? Now it's what I love about this thing is, right? So if I have the same dishwasher. Can you believe that? I've never used my dishwasher before. And my wife is the one recording this actually. She's the cameraman today. Baby, have you used the you know, dishwasher before? Yeah, so we wasted money on this, but I'm sure we will get lazy at some point and we we'll, use it. We'll figure it out. <laughs> but it's, uh, it's, it's, it's beautiful how they finish it up. It's, it's quite beautiful. Um, and then we have the oven here. You know, I have the same oven in the house. So it's basically the same stuff, right? Clean tiles, look at the tiles, look at the details on the ground. Clean tiling. And what I love about it is, look, this stuff, they really brought in like specialized, specialized edges, right? Because usually when we go with the tiling, what we use for the edges is the same tile that we cut for it. But this, you can see that it's like, it's, it's, it's beautifully done, like how when we put the wood on the edge, that's how we do it. It's beautiful. So now everybody's favorite part, is basically the bathroom, and we're gonna to get to that. But for now, this is the living room, right? Uh, very spacious, and like they hate darkness. Minimalistic vibe, right? Like modern minimalistic vibe, very light space. And so they really didn't want to include a lot of colors, 
and they made that very clear they want gray white cream they're about if you decide to you know decorate the place yourself because they do give um interior design services but you know i took that up for myself as you can see here when you put your tv on they got this hole right here for you to you know put all the wires do it they don't want to, they don't want the wires to be hanging i hate stuff like that so when i saw this i was extremely happy now this place when we bought it it comes with everything that i just showed you you didn't have to buy the appliances you know they, they got that top 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 quality appliances in there and uh we will have to obviously put some curtains here if you look out the window you will see that people the people who are already ready and you know renting out their spaces they have these uh curtains for privacy so you can stay in here without the curtains because uh, these windows are very light it's not tinted or anything but come on let's get to the balcony ah let's get to the balcony so we have this beautiful balcony here and this we're gonna put a small table because i could see my neighbors with the same thing a small table and small you know chairs uh we have that at my house so i know exactly where to get this from it's not gonna cost much we may be in one beautiful plant one or two i see a few people doing that here caring about the environment and fresh air so we got a beautiful kids playground here so if you have your kids like i said they get to play here and then we have this beautiful pool there you know all included and we got a gym you know like top notch gym out there that you will have access to and then chilling area they have a lot of stuff downstairs a lot of amenities uh, they got a library they got a nice you know kind of like chilling area really like five star hotel kind of look right so it's it's just it's quite amazing we are done with the living room i showed you guys the kitchen i showed you guys the balcony i showed you guys you know a bit of amenities and stuff like that that you could enjoy while you stay here so now we're going to get to the favorite part the bedroom right uh the bedroom is we have our bed here right the bed just came in we cleaned it up because uh this bed was done about seven months ago but we had a few delays in there and uh finally we got the keys so the bed is in and uh you know everything is on street and we have the we have the bathroom in here beautiful finishes with the bathroom beautiful finishes so this is the bathroom beautiful finishes beautiful finishes bathroom and we have two bathrooms one for each bedroom all right this is bedroom number two and it's no different from the other one everything is exactly the same we got the same beds we got the same wardrobe that came with the with the building a lot of stuff came with it really you just have to put your bed and a few stuff and you're good to go all included um we have the bathroom in here and it's exactly the same it's no different from the other one everything is the same same finishes same tiles and same everything this is it i'm going to walk you guys to the interior design of it or the creation of it and um, it's going to be quite a process so when we are all done we're gonna get a whole video about this professional video and and don't forget if you are come to ghana you want to live like a boss and be in an environment where you meet people that are actually doing something with their lives this is where they are right uh, the price is not too crazy like i said usually for a place like this one bedroom you are paying about 150 to 200 dollars a month a night right yes ghana could be really expensive but we are very modest with it that amount that i just said is going to be how much we want to be charging for these two bedrooms thereabouts right as of 2023 right time changes and the price might change but it's very affordable so if you've not subscribed to the channel already can you do so like the video as it helps the algorithm comment let me know what you think and until next time my friends big legendary peace